how to fix issues with the Columbus Blue Jackets. After losing three of their best players in free agency, the Blue Jackets will be one of the worst teams in the Metropolitan Division. While there isn't anything that can be done to fix the issues right now, Columbus can certainly make their team better for the future. Here is how I would fix the Columbus Blue Jackets. 1. Resign Zach Wierenski. Zach Wierenski is re-signed to an 8-year deal with $8 million per season. 2. Trade Nick Foligno. Columbus Blue Jackets trade Nick Foligno to the Anaheim Ducks for Maxime Comtois, Daniel Sprong, and a second round pick in 2020. 3. Trade for a goalie to tandem with Corpus Allo. Columbus Blue Jackets acquire Jake Allen from the St. Louis Blues for Sonny Milano and a third round pick in 2021. 4. Trade for a second line center. The Columbus Blue Jackets acquire Tyler Johnson from the Tampa Bay Lightning for Oliver Borg strand paul bittner and a second round pick in 2023 five sign the top six winger in free agency the columbus blue jackets signed thomas vanek to a one-year deal worth 2.5 million dollars 2019 2020 columbus blue jackets the first line is maxime comtois pierre luc dubois and cam atkinson the second line is thomas vanek tyler johnson and gustav nyquist the third line is alex texier boone jenner and josh anderson the fourth line is Marcus Hennekeinen, Riley Nash, and Emil Benstrom. The first deep pair is Zach Wierenski and Seth Jones. The second deep pair is Ryan Murray and David Savard. The third deep pair is Dean Kukin and Marcus Nudavara. Goalies are Jake Allen and Jonas Corposalo. The spares are Eric Robinson, Daniel Sprung, and Scott Harrington. The Columbus Blue Jackets might not be a playoff caliber team anymore, but at least they might be a competitive team. Next, how to fix issues with the Detroit Red Wings.